Rich and Ryan are twin brothers. Um, you might not know that by looking at them, but they are. And they go back. Yeah, they go back. They've shared the same heartbeat, the same rhythm since the womb. After high school, we started to hang out. We got a house together. We started jamming. We got so much experience just learning how to hone like our live show and how to work a crowd and how to get the energy up when you want it up and down when you want it down. And we were able to learn all that through covers. And But eventually, it's like it becomes mundane. So we kind of like just made the hard decision like, that's it, you know? We're, we'll, we'll not play as a cover band anymore. We'll come to Brooklyn and we'll, and we'll try this. We moved to New York with like whatever money we had and we just scraped together whatever we could and uh, somehow landed a record deal. Next thing you know, we put our hearts and souls into an album and then it got a couple of Grammy nominations. It's like hard to explain that. The album Mr. Asylum to me uh, means everything. It's completely a reflection of everything I've gone through in a certain span of time. It's a very um, honest album. All the lyrics are directly from my heart and from my own personal experiences. And so it was tough to put some of those out there. You know, it's, it's very, um, it almost leaves you vulnerable. This album to me, it means a lot. It's, uh, it was like the, the, it's the best work we ever put out. You know, we put everything into that album. We were uh, in a hotel room in Chicago when we first found out that we had been nominated and we had played the night before. So we were up kind of all night and our phone started going off really early in the morning. You were up? Yeah. I didn't know yeah, that. you came down and told me in the lounge of the hotel room. We didn't see it coming, so it was pretty cool. Knowing that the Grammy voting process and nomination process is done by um, industry peers and musicians and producers and um, actual people that are in the musical field, it really makes it a little bit more special, I think. And to be recognized by those people, it really feels great. We are extremely excited to be um, recognized in, in a group of people and a group of artists that are just so profound. I mean, Muse is part of the reason we started this band eight years ago, as we were so excited that three guys could do so much with, with, um, with so little. So to be nominated in a category alongside you know, our heroes, that's unreal. It's an unreal feeling. You can't describe it. You can't recreate it.